Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. I'm starting this vlog off at the most random time. It's 6.30 p.m. Today's Monday. I just wanted to start it right now because I wanted to show you guys what I'm eating for dinner. For dinner tonight, I'm just making this chickpea penne that I got last night from Whole Foods. And it's actually literally only made with one ingredient, which I think is awesome. It's just made with chickpea flour. And then I also got this Italian herb pasta sauce. Um, this is just the 365 brand from Whole Foods. And I'm really mad at myself because for whatever reason, I completely forgot to get some kind of meat. I was gonna get like a chicken sausage or something to throw in with the sauce for a little bit of protein and I completely forgot to grab it. So we're just having some noodles and pasta sauce tonight for dinner. But I love getting these pastas because they have so much protein. So I'm still getting my protein despite the lack of meat. before I turn into Starbucks and I can't believe I managed to get out of the house. I used to do this all the time last semester. If you guys had been around last semester for like my college vlogs, I used to go to Starbucks super early in the morning all the time, like before class or even when I didn't have class. Um, and I don't do it anymore. And so now like waking up super early and getting out of the house is like such a challenge for me because I just like lost my ability to do it. now and I was able to go through my entire genetics study guide and I also have like a physical copy so that way I can do the physical copy once I've studied it to kind of like test myself and see how much I know and what I need to work on um, but it's 8 39 Chad's on his way home from work right now and we have a vet appointment for Stetson at like 10 30 I think so we have to take him to that and then we're gonna go to the gym and then I need to go get my nail fixed today. I don't even know if I'm gonna do it at this point. Both of these nails like just completely peeled off and I'm kind of mad because I just got these done like not long ago at all. I may or may not go get these fixed. I don't know. I don't know if it's like a priority. It won't take too long, but if it's busy, it will. Um, so anyway, yeah, we're going to do all that and then I have pretty much just studying all day. Chad and I were gonna do my taxes today, but I don't think I'm gonna do them today because of this exam. I think I'm just gonna wait and do it later this week because my exam is priority right now. Excuse what I look like right now. I have barely any makeup on. I have a little bit of mascara and it's like coming off under my eye. Um, but we're taking Stetson to the vet right now. He's back there. Hi Stetson. Okay, he's ignoring me. Yeah, so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna come home and change and go to the gym and work out legs. And That's right. I'm a little nervous to work out legs because my calves are killing me. I just rolled them out with Chad's foam roller in the garage before we left. And it just feels like my calf muscle is literally like stiff. Like it just feels like it's stuck in the, um, like when you tense it, you know? Like the muscle is like hard, I was telling him. So, it's awful. I'm trying not to be a baby about it. And then I made a green juice right before we left and spilled it all over the counter clean that up and I pay like four dollars or something for those juices so I was so mad because it's not about the fact that I spilled it it's about the fact that it was one of those four dollar juices and now I don't get to drink it so now I'm just drinking water which is probably what I should be drinking anyway we're waiting for the vet to come in as soon as I start recording then he's quiet <laughs> There it is. Back home now, I wanna do a quick gym outfit of the day and then we are heading to the gym. So I am wearing the dreamy sports bra from Gymshark and then these are the black vital seamless leggings. This is just a plain um, white tank from, I think this is from like Marshalls or something so I can't link it, but I will link the stuff that I can link. And then these shoes are the ones I always get asked about all the time so they will be linked below. Um, these are the Adidas Swift Run. I love them so much. You need to get in a lane. 
road rage every time I'm vlogging it happens not because of you I just mean like people do stupid things anyway um, we are heading to GNC because oh let me turn this off before I get copyrighted um, we're going to GNC so that we can get some protein I've been super sore after like every single workout despite the fact that I've been work back to working out for a while now um, so I think it would be really beneficial to incorporate a little bit of protein if you will I'm gonna do a plant-based protein that has BCAAs in it and then obviously I need to stretch more after working out because that's another huge contributor but my diet's pretty good and I'm an overall healthy individual, so I don't know why I've been like so sore, so I wanna try some protein. And Chad doesn't really consume protein anymore after his workouts, and he does um, jujitsu, CrossFit, and weight training, and training at the fire station and all that. He doesn't ever have any um, supplements, BCAs, or protein, but he said that if I got a protein, uh, he would try it with me. So, probably gonna get Alani new. I don't know what flavor yet. But first we have to wait in the long Costco line to get gas for my car. We decided to stop at Staples really quick just to see if they had some antibacterial wipes or hand sanitizer. Literally completely empty. I really just need some wipes to like wipe my phone down and stuff because this coronavirus. And then we checked over here, look, this is all like hand sanitizer, completely empty. People are freaking out and now I can't get any hand sanitizer. Literally just walked around the whole store looking for Alani new and it was right by the front door, so. Okay, here's confetti cake, peanut butter brownie, blueberry muffin, fruity cereal, and chocolate. I really want the confetti cake. Got the protein powder, I'm so excited to try this. I really hope it's as good as everybody raves about. Um, if it's not, I'm gonna be really mad because I just spent like $45 on this. But yeah, this is not the plant-based one. Correction, I was wrong. Only the chocolate one is plant-based, but that's not a big deal to me. I'm not vegan or vegetarian or anything. Like I don't have a strict diet and I really want to try the confetti cake flavor and it just so happens to be whey protein. So I got it. just got out of the gym and we had a really solid workout and I'm about to try this protein I literally threw it in a bag the um, confetti it confetti cake protein powder I forgot the name of it for a second um, because I wanted to try it and I knew that we weren't gonna have time to come home because Chad and I got the spontaneous idea that we should um, well, it's not really spontaneous. We've been talking about it for a while, but it's spontaneous that we decided to do it today. We're gonna go and get my windshield tinted. Um, the rest of my car is tinted, but we never got the windshield tinted and his truck is tinted and I love the way it looks like when he's driving during the daytime. It's just a lot easier on your eyes. So we're gonna go do that because we weren't really planning on doing it today, but then they said they could get us in today. So we decided, why not? I don't wanna add too much. I just like want to get it down. I'm not expecting it to taste like super, super good just mixed with the water because I never really love protein like this. Um, I'm gonna get my real taste test when I attempt to make protein pancakes or when I mix it in and make like a strawberry banana smoothie with the protein in it or something. I feel like that is gonna be more enjoyable for me, but either way, I'm gonna get my protein in. Here's my taste test. I will let you know firsthand, is it worth the hype? Oh my gosh. This is actually so good and I am not lying. Like I had high expectations and for that reason, I thought I was gonna be let down but that's why I just said that whole like disclaimer, probably not gonna be that good with the water, whatever. It's actually really good. It's sweet and the way it makes it like creamy, even though it's mixed with water. I feel like this would be so good mixed with like almond milk too, but obviously I was bringing it on the go so I couldn't do almond milk. Very good. Okay, I'm gonna down this before it gets warm. Oh my gosh. I really like it and I'm so happy that I like it because it was expensive and I was scared I wasn't gonna like it. We're at Target, we dropped my car off and we just need to pick up a couple things. And we figured we'll just check to see, you know, maybe they have some hand sanitizer and disinfectant wipes. No. So then we thought, oh, we'll just get some um, straight up alcohol, you know, and just like wipe our phones down with that. And guess what? Sold out. Oh my gosh. So my mom said we should just get a bottle of vodka. Starting to think that's the only option. We are going to Moe's for lunch and I'm so excited. 
hello focus got a giant burrito with guac in it it's hidden in there somewhere chips and salsa and chad so i am back home and i came home to some packages so i thought i would do a little unboxing these two are for some upcoming um, brand collabs that i'm doing so i'm not going to worry about opening those yet because i want to wait on those but i am going to open this other stuff so First thing is from Misguided. I ordered these forever ago and they took so long to get here, but they are these really cute trendy white sneakers that are like super popular right now and I've seen so many people wearing these and they're just literally misguided and they're so cute. I hope that they fit me. So I'm not sure about my size because I've never ordered shoes from Misguided before. I love the laces though, they're so cute. I look a hot mess right now because I still haven't taken a shower, but we went and picked my car up and I got the tint and the tint is so good, like literally looks amazing. Um, like such a big difference living in Florida and having like your windshield tinted, it just, especially because like every other window is already tinted, so it just blocks all the light from coming in through the front now. Really cool. They are a little bit big but they didn't come in half sizes and I definitely needed a half size so I just went up because I rather than be a little bit too big than a little bit too small so I think they're doable wait a minute I think they sent me what size is this oh no it's the right size it's because it's in UK I was like why does it say six okay, okay. So yeah, I will show you guys these later when I'm actually not wearing sweatpants. And then the other thing, a pair of jeans from Zara. Okay, these are some high-rise ankle-length mom jeans. I hope they fit because I've never ordered jeans from Zara. Um, they were only 40 bucks and these are a size 4. I went with the 4 based on like the size thing. Um, these are going to be another pair that I'm not sure about. I'm actually going to try these on right now though. So here's what they look like. They're just like a classic pair of mom jeans. This is my first pair of mom jeans that does not have rips in them. All the ones I have are like super distressed. So I'm so excited that these are just like that classic mom jean look. Probably could have went down because they feel like a little bit baggy in the back. Um, like around the waistband in the back but to be honest I feel like if I would have went down a size they would look like skinny jeans and that's not the point of these like I want them to have that like loose fit so I mean the back is just like loose I don't know why but that's not a problem I like the way they look it's a while later I just made a coffee and I'm gonna take a shower because I still haven't showered from the gym I know I'm disgusting. I'm working with Function of Beauty on an upcoming video and here is my personalized shampoo and conditioner. I just wanted to show you guys. This video is not sponsored, but I'm going to be working with them soon and I'm about to try it out for the first time. I just got out of the shower. I don't have any makeup on and I might look tan because I just self-tanned. I wasn't going to and then I realized that today's my only day to self-tan before the weekend um, because tomorrow I'm going to be super busy. Tomorrow's my long day and then I work all day Thursday and then I leave Friday morning for Tampa. I'm going to hang out with my sister and her girlfriend for the weekend and I'm probably going to vlog it so I'll bring you guys along with me. But I got a bunch of questions on like two vlogs ago on which self-tanner that I've been using and I've been using a loving tan one. Remember what the name of it is but I will link it in the description if you guys want to check it out I freaking love it so much it's like exceeded my expectations so right now I'm just about to check my lab manual to see what the lab is tomorrow because I believe it's just yeah it's a dry lab I saw that online but I didn't know if there was like a pre-lab for this and I will be so happy if there's not yay it looks like there's like no pre-lab basically we just are working on learning uh, writing and rubric reading. That's awesome. That's gonna save me some time. So I'm not gonna worry about that. I do have to do the uh, quiz. So we have a sample lab report that we have to look at. Oh, it's a PDF. Okay. And I'm gonna have to answer some questions about this. I'm gonna go ahead and do the pre-lab quiz and then I'm going to start working on studying for genetics.
are having chicken sausage and spinach ricotta ravioli. We still been on our HelloFresh kick with like making these meals. We just do like two a week, but we're, I think next week's our last week of doing it. We just did it because we had a coupon. Um, but look at this, this looks amazing. Oh my gosh, I am so excited. So I'm about to eat dinner and I wanna go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog. And if you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.